Um, hi, uh, we're supposed to be doing a video for some kind of zombie gnome thing today, but um, I don't really know where, where, he's, where he's gone. I can't find him anywhere. There's a zombie on the loose, basically. <coughs> Come here, you. Sorry about that, cheeky little monster. So, this is our zombie gnome. As you can see, he's a lot like a normal gnome. He's got a nice big bushy beard. He's got his red hat and he's got his blue jacket. The only difference really being that he's clearly covered in the entrails of his last victim. So, not quite like a normal gnome. He doesn't look normal from the back either. He's covered in blood. He's made from terra cotta. <laughs> so he's perfect for outside use. It's perfect for putting around your pond, for scaring away any herons that might be after your fish. Um, hiding amongst the bushes, certainly gives the neighbour cats a fright. Now I know a lot of people say, oh I actually have one of these myself at home, but I actually do. We've got a picture you can see there, that's my garden, that's my zombie gnome. Not this one, that's mine. Look at that. How did he get, he's got blood in his eyes. His soulless dead eyes are covered in blood, ready to sit in your garden. <sighs> he's like a little me, but with blood. If you'd like to get your hands on your very own zombie gnome, exactly like I have, click here to go to the product page, or if you'd like to see other uh, product videos, unboxings, challenges, and other just fun things to watch online, then click here to go to our YouTube channel and subscribe. Thanks very much. I'm going to put him back in the box before he gets hungry. <laughs>